What's going on guys? Killer6 back with another episode of this gun f***ing sucks. And this time we're taking a look at the carrier. Oh my god. <laughs> Yet another really bad gun. Now, unfortunately, the carrier actually wasn't too bad before the Mayhem 2.0 uh, scaling. But after that, it's just gone severely downhill. This gun has been buffed twice. It got buffed once back toward the very beginning of this game in 2019 they increased the damage by 60 percent and then again in august of 2020 they increased the damage by another 50 percent and still with all those buffs with both of those buffs this gun is still remarkably bad let's go and freeze all these dudes up so we can just sit here and shoot them without them attacking me now what the problem mainly seems to be with this gun is that it has a really cool effect. I don't know if, if you notice what this gun does, but check this out. So let me freeze these guys up. So when you shoot these people, you see all those projectiles come out and fly around and they, they basically they zip around and they try and come back to the person you're shooting to do even more damage, which is a really cool idea, but it just really seems to lack in the damage department. And unfortunately, there's not a whole lot you can do to salvage that with this gun, uh, other than maybe just increase the base damage of the gun. I mean, right now we're doing fairly well. Again, we're on Athena's, we're on Zane. I'm not using the Revolter, however, but the, I am using C and Dead, and Zane gets crazy good gun damage. The annoyment we're using on this thing is action skill and weapon damage for a short amount of time. So uh, if I just shoot my cannon, and then shoot these guys and we'll make it look a little bit better than it is just because of that bonus it's not like the uh the binary operator though this thing will actually do damage to enemies thankfully but not nearly as much as it should so for most good assault rifles we would have cleared that area back there much much faster that said i mean it is killing enemies and if you put the if you put a revolter on with this thing it actually becomes pretty fun here let me actually show you this is the cool thing about the revolter it can be used to make even bad guns into good guns so as you can see if you like the cool effect that the that this gun does you can just pair it with a revolter and have a good time but without the revolter if you don't have dlc 6 you're not going to enjoy this gun at all unfortunately i've heard people say that they actually like it and here let's use its special ability the tracker dart and i missed <laughs> all right that's smooth missed the tracker dart all right let's try it again all right tracker dart there we go and then see those darts come out flying slow and not doing a whole lot of damage so yeah all right so let's pop this and now we should do more damage and we're still tickling this frostbite heavyweight so yeah you kind of get the idea this gun's just uh it's kind of just okay so it sucks it okay let's be honest it sucks but it doesn't suck as bad as a lot of the other sucks guns that we've covered so far to this point it can be used you can kill stuff with it especially on zane flak and amara with a phase grasp you would have a good time mose would actually probably do the worst with this thing out of all the vault hunters believe it or not <laughs> but i don't know man i i really i want to like this gun i really do when i did my atlas allegiance zane i really wanted to to make good use of this gun but luckily we found a q system instead because Q system is miles and miles superior to this gun and the OPQ system now is a base game gun because uh, they give us the, the cartels for free with the game so no good reason to use the carrier that I can think of you don't get this gun until you go and fight uh, Judge Hightower in Electra City if you want to get it from its dedicated source uh, that said this thing can world drop and just like that we're out of ammo so that's it for this episode of this gun f***ing sucks let me know down in the comment section below have you used the carrier do you actually like it also let me know down there below which gun you'd like to see next on this gun f***ing sucks hope you guys enjoyed this episode if you did make sure you hit that like button hit subscribe tap the bell icon for more and i'll see you in the next one take care